Dams in the Columbia River Basin provide clean, renewable, reliable, flexible, and efficient hydropower. Navigation locks on the Lower Columbia and Snake Rivers help transport about 10 million tons of cargo each year. Dams also help prevent flooding and provide outdoor water-based recreation opportunities. While not the only cause of declines in fish populations, dams have altered adult salmon and steelhead migration upstream from the ocean. To make dams more transparent to fish, the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers has completely overhauled its dams and pioneered some of the most advanced fish research in the world. The Corps uses adaptive management. Adaptive management basically means that as we get new information, we go back and relook at our policies and, and decide whether there's an adjustment that should be made that would benefit survival of salmon better. To save the salmon, the Corps has partnered with the National Marine Fisheries Service and Bonneville Power Administration. The National Marine Fisheries Service oversees recovery of listed salmon species. They took on that responsibility from the state management agencies when these salmon and steelhead became listed under the Endangered Species Act. It's a complex effort with many components. A strong instinctual drive takes adult fish on a difficult journey upriver to birthplace spawning grounds. Fish ladders help adults move upstream. Juvenile fish are tagged to study their migration patterns downstream to the ocean, plus their eventual return upstream to spawn a new generation. A key effort is the Corps' Juvenile Fish Downstream Transportation Program. To avoid hazards, juveniles are collected at dams on the Snake and Columbia Rivers. Then they're barged or trucked downstream and released below Bonneville Dam, the last dam downstream on the Columbia River. Special spillway weirs help juveniles avoid hydropower turbines. And the Corps is developing fish-friendly turbines to improve juvenile survival. Dorsak Dam in Idaho provides cooling water to help fish downstream survive in hot weather. Adaptive fish management and fish recovery efforts have helped. Adult steelhead and Chinook salmon have been returning upstream in record numbers. Juvenile fish survival at Corps dams has improved dramatically in recent years. There's, there's never an end to making improvements. However, we feel that we've done very well. Today's increasing fish numbers reflect extensive efforts. Corps efforts to save the salmon are working. The Corps plans to build on this success.